Alright, so Batman crashes through the fucking ceiling. He's here to fight Two-Face's goons. Uh, but this one fucking dude who's next to Nicole Kidman is like, Batman, eh. Like, he's kind of scared. Like, maybe Batman's there for him. Be great if he just fucking shows up and ignores Two-Face and the Riddler and arrests this one fucking weirdo on paid parking tickets. But what's weird is, is that Nicole Kidman doesn't seem to notice that Batman has crashed to the ceiling until this guy points it out. Like, she's the only one not looking. Like, she didn't hear the glass break, the commotion. She didn't notice the fucking guy in a bat costume with nipples on it flying to the ceiling. She didn't notice any of that shit until this fucking guy next to her was like, Batman, eh, and pointed. She looks where he points. It's fucking weird. I don't know. I just think that there's a lot of backstory that we're not really aware of. Maybe we'll find out in the fucking Schumacher cut that everyone is pretending to want to see now of this garbage movie.